Hi everybody, it's Jilly, Jilly B living her life her way. I hope you're all safe, well and happy. I have been on Sheen. I went on Sheen because I saw a dress that I thought, oh that's really nice and it was quite cheap. Um, I'm not a fast fashion girl, I don't tend to buy fast fashion clothing. Um, but I saw the dress and I thought, I'll, I'll, I'll buy it. And um, it's just a black dress and it's got a crocheted waistband and... Um, Mm, I haven't tried it on yet, not sure, but anyway, I went on Sheen to buy the dress, but while I was on there, I thought I'd do buy some more things that I didn't need, and I thought because I didn't need them so much, I would show you. It's all post-crossing craft related items, so grab a cup of tea, a coffee, a cold drink, sit back and watch what I've bought. So the bag's quite big, this is it. So I'm just going to sit it to the side, quite noisy isn't it, and I'll just put my hand in, it's just here, and I'll put my hand in and pull something out and we'll see what I've bought because I can't remember everything. So the first thing is this, what is this? Um, oh it's material paper, that's right, and it's, uh, I think it's Alice in Wonderland's themed and I thought it would be quite good for um, the artist trading cards that's what I was, I was that was the theme I was thinking of they're quite thin but on the other hand um, I've got a blank I have a blank postcard here I was thinking I could maybe make a postcard I could just mess about like this like this, you know, and jazz it up a bit. That was my thinking. I'll leave that there, I might need that again. So that is the first thing out of the bag. Alison Wonderland themed papers. And like I said, these are all from Sheen. The next thing is my order slip. We'll throw that to the side. Uh, washi tape by the looks of it. Grab some scissors. Let me see. Yep, this is cat washi tape. Lots of people on post crossing love cats, don't they? So, cat washi tape. Oh, what is this? Ah, so I bought some beads. Um, it's got, even got the thread in. This is um, a project I'm working on at work so i saw that at a good price i'll not open it because no my they will go everywhere but as you can see beautiful colors and shapes stars circles pearlescent little hearts there so there was that next thing is oh halloween washi Um, I'm sure I have Halloween washi somewhere, but in my defence, you can never have enough Halloween washi, so I bought more. Really nice, isn't it? I love the colours. Uh, so yeah, Halloween washi. What is the next thing? This is thin. What is this? Oh, some unicorn stickers. Glitter Magic. So these are unicorn stickers for the unicorn gang. If you don't know what I'm talking about, some a few years ago, probably, I sent Renee Lewis, uh, she's got her own channel, Renee Lewis, a postcard. And on the postcard, I put a sticker on that said unicorn gang. And we just had a little giggle about it. So then we've sort of made a unicorn gang group. So unicorn gang. Some more beads and these are all little smiley faces oh some washi now I got this washi because it was a bit different it's um clear washi so let's just pull some out let's see if I can get it to get the end for it so let's see 
Oh, you have to peel it off. But can you see it on? Oh, you can't really see it very well, can you? So they're all a bit different. That's a daisy print. And then you just peel the back of it off. I won't undo all of them because they might unravel. But I really do like this one. Try not to get the glare of the lamp involved. So, yep. Some washi tape with a bit of a twist. That's quite good. What's next? Oh, this is a big box. Oh, well, lo and behold, if it's not more washi tape, can I rip? I'm going to carefully rip this one off because I can reuse that bag for something else. I sell a lot of things on vintage and I always like some extra bags. So this is washi tape here and it's um Fantasy Unicorn series. Isn't that lovely? Can you see all the different colours and themes? So that'll go well with the unicorn stickers. Next, what is this? This one thing? Quite bulky. Oh yeah. So these are postcards. Peel that down again because I can reuse that. Plastic is just horrendous, isn't it? How much plastic we get. But I like to give all plastics an extra go at life. So in these, I've got some stickers to go with them. And I think these are food related. I can't remember. So these are food advert. Um, quite a good thickness actually there's nothing on the back but that's fine cracker jack now i don't know some of these you might know them i think they're more of an american one let me know in the comments club heartbreak mark ronson special guest august 15th mm, no idea a fine fine cake needs a fine fine flour swan down cake flour and there's a little recipe on there. So, you know, some people like a recipe. Some people like vintage adverts, don't they? Starch the hard way. Oh, dear. <laughs> Valentine's one. Wow. These are, oh, look at this. I have Pepsi, but I like refreshment. Look how beautifully that lady, the ladies are dressed there. See the cigarettes on there? That is a blast from the past, is it not? Love songs. I oh, know we do get cornflakes in this country. I like cornflakes. Jello, we don't get jello. I think we can get it in the American themed shops over here. Lemon pie, we call that lemon meringue over here. Um banana spice cake, that sounds awful. Pancakes, colour vision cake. Waffles in one minute. Hmm. Processed stuff, isn't it, really? Some of the desserts. Anyway, so Rice Krispies, we get Rice Krispies over here. Jello again. Fruit Market Cherry. So, yeah, I didn't need these postcards, let's face it. Who needed these postcards? I certainly didn't. Oh, look at that. The size of that freezer. A carefree kitchen is the heart of your home. What a load of old rubbish. Milk and honey. That's a nice one. Cheese it's high ho crackers. We get some crackers and they're called Ritz. A bit like that. They're really nice. So there we go. I think that's all of them. So, guys, in the comments, you'll have to tell me if you recognise any of these type of old adverts. So, I won't try and put them back in the packet because that'll be just silly. It'll take me all day. So, that's those. What's next? Oh, more beads for a project. I used to jewellery make back in the day, back a long time ago. Maybe 15 years ago, and I got rid of all my jewellery making equipment. And then I started to make simple 
bangles at work and that not gosh you can't speak just single sim, simple bead bracelets and now i'm hooked again so i've got more but uh that dad guy he um he's got an art project he wants people to send the art into him so i might make some of it and send it to him now is this the same as this i think it is isn't it so i won't open that i don't know why he got two I won't open one because I've already opened one, so that's okay. Let's put that there. I've got much more. Let's have a look. More unicorn stickers. To be fair, I did need more unicorn stickers. Right, what have we got here? Oh, Halloween. Now, as you recall, I bought Halloween washi. And I bought some. I did need some Halloween postcards. I didn't. I don't have that many left from last year. I did send quite a lot last year. So let's have a quick look. Now they're not the thickest cards, so I could possibly. Yeah, they're the same. Is it the? Oh, it's not the same set. Well, I could stick that on there, couldn't I? If I wanted to make it a bit thicker for the mail, I think I could manage to do that. That's a bit of a creepy face, isn't it? Oh, I don't like that one. This is the sort of like with a black and orange. These aren't as good as the ones I got last year from um, a company. I forget which one it was, like my favourite postcard or someone like that. I bought some. Very similar. Oh, that's a good one. So they're not the thickest, but I, I'll, I'm all right with that. Oh, look at that one. That is cool. One ghosties. Oh, that's a bit creepy. Mm, don't like that one. There's some duplicates here. Oh, I like that one. Bex has your name written all over that one, doesn't it? Bex is a friend of mine. Um, Renee's, Smokies and Rob's and probably others as well. She loves cats and Halloween's one of her favourite times of the year. That's a bit weird. Is that a po that's a like figure of a person with a pumpkin head. Some of these are a bit creepy for me. Oh, I like that one. It reminds me of uh, the Christmas tree, the shape. Oh, I like that one. Oh, creepy, creepy, cute. That's creepy, but I like it. Cute, creepy, cute-ish, cute. Hmm. Oh, that's a lovely one. I really like that one. That's a cool one as well just walk along the path and be scared don't you i like that one so i know it's not halloween yet but sometimes you just have to go go ahead of it don't you and just grab what you need while you see it but they're okay these are from sheen i wouldn't have spent a lot of money on them i can't give you prices i'm afraid because the prices are in my phone that's that one the next thing i bought was washi tape more washi tape if you know me you know i have lots of washi tape however if i see a washi tape that's cool i'll buy it and this one is like stamps but they're mushrooms so that's really cool isn't it and i that had a i had an autumn theme in mind for that one so that's cool anything else oh more beads more beads i think i went a bit crazy on the beads didn't i stickers now these are unicorn stickers which will be handy for the unicorn club to pop on a postcard or an envelope oh they're really nice i'm really pleased about them and they weren't a lot of money either if i remember rightly 
put them back in the sleeve there. I need to find the correct tub for my unicorn stickers to go into. Now then, is there anything left in this huge bag? Uh, is that it? Two, two more things. More beads. Smiley faces. That's two of them, isn't it? Some letters. Some pearlescent stars. More. How many smiley faces did I buy? Oh my goodness, I don't think I'm meant to buy that many. And uh, I'll so put them over there. A bit overcrowded on this side. I'm trying to keep things separate. And what's in here? Ooh, more stickers. And I think these might be a Halloween theme to go with the uh, Halloween postcards and what have you. Oh, boo. These are like gonks or gnomes, whatever you call them. They're not the thickest postcards. They're not the thickest. Um... Oh, that's cute. Spooky note. That's the sort of spooky note I want to see. Oh, that's cute. I like that. I like the way that the pumpkins are a diff different colour as well. These are really nice. Happy Halloween. Really nice. Happy fall, y'all. <laughs> We're spooky and we know it. Well, these are really quite fun. Love. Isn't that sweet? These are really nice. So, yes, I bought a lot of things that I didn't necessarily need, but these things are going to come in handy. Now, I know Renee had a sticker. She stopped buying them because she had quite a few. But um, I've been slowly buying them, but some, some stickers are actually run out quite quickly. Um, I couldn't find any more of my Ukraine rounds, um, different shape stickers. So I went on eBay, oh look at that, and I bought some Ukraine stickers, the, the, the flag, just to remind folk, you know, let's not forget what those people are going through over there. Um, and things like Halloween and that, when that season, whatever season's coming up, I like to buy things in advance so that I know when I'm sending out postcards, and I do send a lot of um seasonal postcards out in postcrossing and to friends i like to make sure i've got plenty so that i can send them out um already for the season plus i like to add a few in an envelope if i'm sending th things in an envelope as well to my friends and what have you but yeah they're really good i'm really happy with them so that's my little halloween prep done isn't it i've got ha i've got washi i've got um halloween postcards, Halloween um, stickers there, I've got my unicorn, I did need to bulk up on the unicorn because I was getting a bit thin on the ground with the unicorn stickers but I love the fact I've got matching um, different washies there that are unicorn themed but also really pretty for anybody really, that's really cool, the transparent washi would be quite good on a dark postcard or envelope or something i like the food ones the nostalgia um woman's day them donuts look really nice don't they joe parker donuts ja jelly donuts we call them jam donuts gosh and did you notice everything in there was incredibly bad for you and um i suppose some of these advertisements um from like the 50s and that's when processed foods started to become more popular i try to stay away from processed foods if i'm to be being honest with you i still eat processed foods but i try not to she just it's just junk isn't it really so too much salt too much sugar 
that's what's prob the problem in this world, I think, some of the problems. Our diets. Anyhow, that is my little haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked what I bought. Let me know in the comments what you liked. Um, would you like to see some results of my um, jewellery making? I've also ordered more jewellery making items. These are very basic because... Um, that's what I needed for the project I've got. Um, I could make some. I, I need some the thread. I've left it somewhere. So I'll have to find. Oh, there is thread in there. I could make something up. Let me know in the comments if you want a tutorial on how to make um, a bead bracelet. Um, soon I'll be making some necklaces and earrings. So if you're interested in seeing that, please let me know in the comments and I will see what I can do. So guys, that is that um, video for today. I hope you enjoyed it. Please let me know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe. I also like to hear what you've got to say, how you're getting on. Just let me know. All right, guys, until the next video, stay well, safe and happy. Bye bye now. Bye bye.